36 Commuting Solutions 10-year anniversary, a decade of progress for US 36. If you travel Highway 36 between Denver and Boulder, you know this corridor is a special place to live, work, and play. With global companies, robust communities, and unparalleled natural beauty, the US 36 corridor embodies many of the reasons we choose to live in Colorado. According to regional forecasts, the population along US 36 is expected to rise 22%. Employment will expand 40%, causing traffic volumes to increase dramatically over the next 15 years. Inevitably, more people means more cars, more pollution, and more congestion. For 10 years, 36 Commuting Solutions has been dedicated to preserving the quality of life along US 36. 36 Commuting Solutions engages key constituents um, as we have done the past 10 years and will continue to do into the future all along the way into the main issues and needs of this corridor. They are the voice for US 36, successfully banding together public and private sector stakeholders to advocate for a comprehensive multimodal transportation system along US 36. Often referred to as the Boulder Turnpike, this highway was built in 1952 as a four-lane toll road. It was and is today the main connection between Denver and Boulder. Other than adding a few interchanges, very few improvements have been made to the Turnpike since its original construction. Air quality and traffic congestion concerns are not new to this area. In fact, 36 Commuting Solutions was formed to address these very issues a decade ago. Explosive growth in the Denver metro area led to the pollution brown cloud that raised serious questions about the quality of air in Metro Denver. The Denver Regional Council of Governments approved a three-year grant uh, through congestion management air quality funding, knowing that the congestion in the corridor was growing, knowing that we'd have another air quality bubble where we really were going to have to take some action. Also at this time, the jurisdictions along US 36, in partnership with Carter and Burgess Engineering Firm, created the first corridor-wide transportation plan to reduce traffic congestion. 36 Commuting Solutions was formed as a recommendation of this study. The Broomfield Economic Development Corporation saw the linkage between economic development and regional access and provided a foundation for this organization to take shape. So with, with uh, minimal tools, including flip charts and markers, we, we set up to begin business. When the executive committee and the board of the Broomfield Economic Development Corporation uh, met, they invited me to stay because I had nowhere else to go. But it was really great fun and uh, something uh, built from the ground up. In the early days of the TMO, we were focused on getting basic bus services in place, the ability to move people around, set the stage for the current days of 36 Commuting Solutions efforts to work with employers. 36 Commuting Solutions has a three-pronged approach to improve traffic congestion on Highway 36. First, they focus on advocacy and building regional consensus around transportation issues. 50 plus businesses along the corridor of varying sizes, small business, medium business, large business, those businesses are joining together with the government side to really um, bring forward both the improvements uh, as well as the funding. 36 Commuting Solutions also works closely with the U.S. 36 Mayors and Commissioners Coalition to advocate at a state and national level for increased transportation funding as well as the completion of the Northwest Rail Commuter Rail Project that is part of the RTD Fast Tracks program. And it was really a coming together of the diverse communities along the corridor when then, then Mayor Bill Behrens of Broomfield and I at the time the mayor of Boulder walked into an RTD meeting arm in arm supporting the same thing. People just about fell out of their seats and it had enormous power. The US 36 coalition has achieved national recognition for its unique consensus building abilities. I really think of 36 Commuting Solutions as a model for building coalition, for building regional coalition. And it's a model not just for Colorado, but really for the country. 36 Commuting Solutions' second major goal is to enhance the commute services available in the corridor. They provide the service in many ways, including working with RTD to expand bus service, including piloting RTD's call and ride service, and helping to launch Boulder County's Dash and Lynx bus routes. Encouraging bicycle commuting by creating a corridor-wide bicycle map and hosting an annual Bike to Work Day breakfast station. Growing the number of carpools and van pools in partnership with Dr. Cog Rider Rangers program. 
first of all, they understand public transit. But what they've really done for us is they become our eyes and ears in the community. And we know that if we work through this group, we have access to the entire range of interest in the corridor, which is where we need to be at the end of the day if we're ever going to get anything done and maintain that strong regional consensus. Their third goal is to get people out of their cars and into cleaner commute options. 36 Commuting Solutions continues to pilot innovative strategies to reduce single occupant travel. They launched 36 Commuter Cash, a program that pays commuters who currently drive alone when they make the switch to a cleaner commute alternative such as carpool, vanpool, or riding the bus. In its first 90 days alone, this program reduced vehicle miles traveled by over 142,000 miles, which equals 15 trips around the Earth's equator. Right now, a big factor on people's minds is their commute, the price of gas, um, ways that they can impact the environment in a positive way. There are other options. We have a specialized parking spot for people that manpool and carpool. Um, and that was certainly something that 36 Commuting Solutions helped us come up with. 36 Commuting Solutions has accomplished a lot in the last 10 years, but there is still much more to do. In the next few years, U.S. 36 commuters will see exciting changes in the options to travel between Denver to Boulder and Longmont. During the construction of the highway component, 36 Commuting Solutions will be mitigating congestion using transportation demand management strategies. And ultimately, our focus will shift more to consumers and to the overall commuters. Transportation demand management is completely critical to the success of our transportation system. You can't build your way out of congestion. That you need a multimodal um, solution to any corridor. The vision for sustainable travel includes commuter rail, bus rapid transit, managed lanes, and a bikeway. Today we are very focused on completing the planning process for both the US 36 final EIS as well as the Northwest Rail Project. It looks like it's going to come in ahead of some of the other corridors and, and having that decision document in place will play a major role in being able to secure funding as it comes in the door. As this vision becomes reality, 36 Commuting Solutions will be here to advocate for highway funding, to deliver a robust menu of commuting options to the corridor, and to encourage more sustainable commuting behavior. We all agree to what we want to see have happen, but not all of the funding is in place. So it's important that 36 Commuting Solutions is active in bringing that funding forward. And we just look forward um, to what lies ahead and we have great hope and determination to bring forth a, a robust multimodal vision that benefits the communities and businesses along this corridor. We will be here to ensure the US 36 region remains a special place to live, work, and play.